Welcome back everyone. In this video I'm gonna show you how to run Windows programs on Linux. This is a very easy and simple process to do. My current distro is Linux Mint, but this will work on different distros if you follow the tutorial. Alright, let's get right into the video. First, head up to Wine's official website to download the latest version from its repository. You can still search in Google to find the official website too. So now we need to click download button at here to find official repositories. Scroll down a little bit, then select your distro. Mine is Mint, which is Ubuntu based, so I'll select Ubuntu. And there you go! We just need to copy these commands and paste them in our terminal to install Wine. You need to be careful in this part, because you need specific distro name to install Wine that is eligible for your distro. First, copy the command and paste the terminal. Now, at this part, we see two in the code names. One of them is version and the second one is Ubuntu. If both are present, we are going to look at Ubuntu code name. Mine is Jammy. Now, you need to download and add the repository. Just copy that long command and paste to the terminal. Now in this part, you need to choose your distro name, also known as the code name yourself. Mine is Jammy, so I'll copy the command that is on Jammy and run it. After running all those commands, we are pretty much done. You just need to update the repository. Then you can install Wine versions from using your package manager. All you need to do is to just copy the command and paste it to the terminal. I recommend you to use stable version. Now this will take a while. After download finishes, we need to run Wine command to let it configure its files. Just simple type one config. Now this part will take a while. After the setup finishes, you'll see a pop up like this. You can select your Windows versions from there. Also, you can change settings of other things like sounds or etc. But this is not necessary to change unless required. So now I'll show you how to run Windows programs using Wine. In this example, I'll download Keypass Portable and Setup version, then run it. I'm gonna create a folder called Test and move Keypass files to there. You're going to run Keypass EXE. First, copy the direction of your EXE file and CD into that in terminal. You can see EXE file. Now run it by just simply typing wine and the name of the exe file. All these crazy codes is the logs of the program, not a black magic. You can just minimize the terminal. This is after update menu. Alright, as you can see the keypad is launched and it's working fine. There is even a tray icon. Now, if you close terminal or stop the command, your program will be closed. To prevent that, you can just set default program to launch exe files as fine. This way, you can just double click your programs to run without terminal. If your program requires 64 bit system, you can just run wide command again with a 64 at the end. This will launch a program in 64 environment.
Now, if you want to see your C drive, you just need to go to the .one folder in your home directory. This is the C drive and all the stuff that exists on the C drive. Your programs are usually located in the program files folder. As you can see, the keypad is right there too, and the executable file is right there. You can launch it from there too, or create a desktop shortcut to access it easily. And that's it for this video. I'll also upload a new video about how to run games in Linux easily. If you want to keep your Linux as your daily drive, you can watch that too. As always, see you later.